Hey, what's up guys? This is going to be kind of a new series here, kind of in line with um, Farthest Frontier um, that I played before. Um, this is going to be a game called Settlement Survival. Um, cool little game. Uh, it's a colony builder just like uh, the Farthest Frontier. And uh, yeah, I hope it's, uh, it's kind of cool. We're going to look into it here and see what it's all about. Kind of a bummer, they're gonna have to carry all that back over there, but it's okay. I find it hard to believe that we don't have enough stone, but there it is. Um, let's take this right here and that right there. Uh, we've got March. March has arrived. Uh, we're going to turn on these buildings now. Our labor force is going to go down quite a bit, but we'll have food coming in. And uh, we'll also have flax for the first time. The uh, cemetery is being built over here. Little island cemetery. Oh, looks like uh, they changed their mind. They're going to go home before they finish it. Here we are. Boom. There you have it. Now our people have a place to rest if they happen to fall down while walking across the uh, little field right here. <laughs> How did that person die? You yeah, can't be kidding me. Maybe it's a scripted thing, like a tutorial, basically. Forrester seems to be doing work over here. He's uh, planting trees. This year he's brought in uh, 51 logs so far. Last year it was only 180, so uh, we should see more logs coming in from him. There's actually three of them out here. It's 57 already, okay. Looks like we're in a good spot on domestic fuel. Um, our production is better than our consumption, and that's exactly what we want to see. So, uh, The clinic is now open. Um, we've got only one laborer left. Um, but the doctor here will be healing citizens with like fractures and things like that and uh, Hopefully they won't be dying Here comes the flax And we're gonna have that trade ship coming in any minute now Health is 85 out of 200. Sprained ankle, but I think they've been treated, so that's good. Or they are being treated anyway. Uh, that guy seems to have healed just fine, uh, so that's that's good. The chapel is where or the uh, clinic is working. Uh, we got a new seed. Uh, oat seeds, okay. Can be used for brewery. Seeds can be collected in the wild. Yep. Uh, it looks like we actually gathered a seed from up here. Um, there was one over there. And now there is not. Ah, the lumber mill uh, got put up. Um, so what we want here... There's only one worker, actually. Um, I'm just going to go ahead and tell them. 
to, let's see, okay, so five logs makes 10 domestic fuel. And then over here, we've got 10 logs. Oh, wait, hold on. Five logs makes 10 domestic fuel. Um, interesting. Maybe this is just faster, I guess. Oh, you know what it is? Five logs, ten domestic fuel. Yeah, never mind. I thought it would be cheaper, but it's not. Daily stamina consumption is five here. It's five here. Days needed six. Days needed fifteen. Okay, so they can make it in about half the time. Um, so we're gonna turn this guy off. We're gonna turn this on, and then we'll have one worker. Um, and we'll go ahead and just delete this building. I think. Here we go. Yep, we're going to take that out of here. I will be producing firewood twice as fast over in this building right here. And then if we absolutely need to, we can get another one for doing planks and such. And that's the end of the tutorial anyway. Um, so you can see here, we pretty much now that we have all these base buildings, we have free reign to do more or less whatever we want. Um, but what I want is I want more citizens. So uh, we need a few more jobs. I'm going to go ahead and build a couple more houses here. Make sure they're covered up by both of these. It looks like we're good. Yeah, we're going to need a few more citizens to do some of the jobs that we're getting through here and we need more laborers um and then we probably need to get more timber going i would think We're at 108% happiness. I uh, didn't think that was possible, but... Work efficiency plus 10% for every extra 25% happiness when over 100. So we're at 108. Um, looks like they get a massive bonus from uh, being really happy. I can fit 18 bodies in this cemetery. That's not nearly enough. Looks like we do have uh, some people moving in uh, and they will be having children. And you know what? Um, speaking of children, why don't we build a school? That would be good. We'll make sure these kids get brought up right. Uh, I think we'll build it out here next to the fields. Let's see, I can fit it in. Yeah, we can fit it in on this side. It actually lines up like perfect. Now, we don't have a teacher yet, but my tailor actually isn't doing anything. Uh, so let's go ahead and just take her off of tailoring for the moment. We'll close that. Um, they can be a laborer here. And these fields are done for the winter. So we can go ahead and take them off. Oh wait, this one's actually not done. There's still a little bit of work to be done out here. Alright, now they're done. Monica's working over here. It looks like she's just hauling things. Now she's taking a break. They're both resting. Uh, go ahead and disable that. 
get some more laborers going. And I think the ship should be coming in any minute now. Yep, here it comes. A citizen got injured. Ankle sprained. Uh, that's pretty standard. Um, Alright, let's hire a worker for the dock and let's see if we can make some trades here. And this is what? The year two, so... Run, 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 max speed. I mean, I'm already into year two, and it's been about 43 minutes. A game, it's kind of a slower pace, I think, than uh, Settlement Survival. Annual production is 152, consumption is 122. Um, so it doesn't seem like we're actually producing that much more. 126 just this year. We've got a teacher in the school now. Um, she's giving a lecture to students. It looks like there's 10 kids out there. 11 kids out there. And we've got the merchant ship at the dock. So let's see what we have here. Chili seeds. <laughs> and herb seeds. Now these are extremely expensive. But I got about 6,000 gold from uh, all those quests. So I think what I'm going to do is buy the herb seed. Chili seeds grown on the field, fast maturing, but low yield. I wonder what chili is, like, good for. Grown in the nursery. Alright, let's do this transaction. We've got a new seed. Um, as far as the nursery goes, I don't know what that is. We've got a plantation here, a corral, and a forest farm. Maybe it's science. Who knows? Boarding school. Nursery kind of sounds like hospital, but apparently it's not that. I doubt it would be in mining. Jade house. here. Yeah, I don't see it. Uh, we do have two technology points though. Uh, so let's go over here to processing and let's get the weaving. Uh, this is going to allow us to turn all that flax into an actual usable good. So um, we've got the water sawmill the tailor or the text or textile water mill and that's what we want oh look at that it like fits perfectly how lucky am i that's nuts okay boom there's our road the water textile mill is going in we're just desperate for more workers and laborers um that would be really good to see Seems like we're pretty low on water. Let's take a look here. Annual production is 300. Annual consumption is 366. So we need to hire another water carrier uh, without a doubt.
Um, I don't think there's any other trade to be done here. Let's go ahead and turn our vendor guy off. And then I need to see something here. Agriculture. Orchard. Fishing dock. Maybe if I look up here in... I would think it would be like technology. Tools, textiles, clothing, or hmm. I don't actually see it here. I do see uh, herbs, though. Gathered by workers in the field or gathering, hut, gatherers, hut, and nursery. So it looks like maybe we can set staple foods, oat, raw materials. Yeah, it's not here. Um, so we can't grow it here. We need a nursery, and I don't know how to get that. Moving on, though. Moving on. The uh, textile water mill is going up. They're hammering away on it. goes the <laughs> trade ship right through the bridge. Um, that's very majestic looking. See you later, later buddy. Okay, so we've got the textile mill. Uh, we're going to tell him to turn flax into linen. Beautiful. And he will do that. Here, The only thing is, is now we have quite the labor shortage. And we're going to be going into the spring. So we need to make some decisions fast here on where we want people working. A lot of children. The houses are pretty full. Um, maybe what I should do is just open up a few more houses and we can try to expand our workers population here. So we'll build like three in. A group of wild geese made their homes by the field, not only pecking at the seedlings in the field, but also attacking passerbys in the group from time to time. We can slaughter them, or we can tame this group of geese. Let's tame them. After some struggle, the farmers drove the geese into the enclosure, and after a few feedings, they finally managed to tame the geese. Uh, okay. New livestock. Town details. Ah, uh, and this is what we're looking for. Uh, oh, that's what I was looking for before. Uh, yeah, we have geese. Um, it looks like they produce manure. And when we slaughter them, we get like goose feathers and goose meat. Interesting. This is uh, exactly what I was looking for. So we want raw materials. Hmm. 
it's not food. And it's not textile. Not beverage, obviously. Uh, industrial fuels? No, that's not going to be a trade goods. We got tobacco there. What we're looking for is... Oh, household goods. Okay, so herbs are household goods. We've got to find some way to actually be able to produce those. Um, we'll get it figured out. New houses are going in. People are moving in. Uh, Gavin, who is a farmer. Apparently there's still two farmers on this field. Um, who have just been kind of chilling this winter. We got uh, Joseph, the hunter. He's getting a new house. For 16, he's got a pretty majestic goatee. <laughs> Very nice. And then we've got Murphy, the cleric. She's a level 7 cleric. Um, you don't want to mess up, mess around with Murphy. The roads are being built. And I'm pretty sure March is about to come through. There's four laborers. Uh, so yeah, I'm going to have to take some people off of some jobs here. Uh, let's go ahead and take... I'm going to turn off the repair shop. And I'm going to take Rod off the uh, well. And then we can turn these fields back on and hopefully get a full harvest out of them. Uh, we were able to produce quite a bit of uh, flax. There's 402 in total res uh, reserve, so it's good to see. Apparently there's uh, some geese that have been slaughtered and carried over here. We have 88 linen in um, storage, so that's good. Once he runs out of flax to work with, if he does, um, we'll move him over to work that uh, linen into clothing. So that should work out pretty good. And we kind of think we just kind of have to wait. We had a birth last season, that's good. Nobody has moved in with uh, these guys yet. Maybe they're not old enough. Our oldest one is uh, Benson here, who looks much closer to 16 than uh, Joseph. Uh, Benson is a forester out here in the fields. He's got like elven ears for some reason. Here we see the uh, fields have been plowed and planted. Good to see. Our farmers are killing it. And we've only got about 102 flax left. Now, uh, this should be a pretty stable production line. Like, we're getting the flax every season. It'll be worked in the mill over the winter. And then clothing will be produced probably in the summer here. Which will pretty much set them up for the winter on the next season. Um, that'll be really nice. We 
we got all these children. Uh, we're starting off with Sam here. And she is six years old, it looks like. Yeah. I think it has the oldest one at the top, so... We've got another six-year-old. Another six-year-old. And another six-year-old. Cooper. There's a lot of children wandering around. They have three and then two. So... <clears throat> It'll be a little while before these guys will be able to do anything. A couple years, in fact. Um, we're going to be looking for this. This is perfect. The immigrants have reached this area. Coming to your town. Possess town hall to accept the immigrants. So, uh, what it's telling us is that we essentially have to build a town hall. And the immigrants that stop on by, uh, they will be accepted there. So this is inside of the area. I could build houses here. Um, I'm kind of thinking I get rid of this building right here, the repair shop. Uh, let's go ahead and demolish this thing real quick. And maybe the town hall will fit in. Oh, it's too big. Far too big. Maybe we can fit that in like here. Yep, yep, it's going to be just too big. Uh, maybe instead of demolishing that building, we'll just build the uh, town hall over here. You know what, let's do that. I think it looks pretty nice. Let's go ahead and cancel the demolish. We should see the uh, town hall getting worked on immediately here. It's the newest building. Still have to make it all the way through winter in order for that to happen, but uh, okay, we've run out of flax, and this is awesome. Um, let's go ahead and turn off the textile mill. Or hold, maybe I should leave it on and then just take a worker out of there. And we're gonna move Tyler over here. This guy is the real deal. Tyler makes all his clothing from locally sourced flax fields. And, uh, man, it's smooth on your skin. It's, it's crazy. Feels like, uh, you're wearing just garments made for gods. <laughs> Farmers are working away here. This field's getting cleared up. And it looks like there's a little kid out here. Cooper. Alright, both of these guys are resting. Let's go ahead and turn this field off. We'll get them working somewhere else for the time being. Uh, this field is done. Everybody's kind of out here scratching their heads. They're like, what do I do? Um, let's give them something to do, shall we? Okay, so realistically, what's going to happen is we're going to run into clothing problems. We're going to run into water problems. And... see here uh, let's take a look at water here so last year we produced 357 I don't know how this is supposed to work um We've got 637, we've used 971. Man, 
Hey, thank you guys so much for watching. If you have any free time, feel free to stop by the stream. I would love to see you there. Um, you guys are always welcome. Thanks.